to another video and welcome to vlogmas i am going to be doing vlogmas today which is super exciting i did it last year and the year before i think and it's so fun and it's also fun to look back on what i did all of december and like the holiday vibes so i'm going to do it again which i'm really excited for the first few days of it is going to be a little bit rough and probably some shorter videos because um it is the last few weeks of first term and then it's exams so it's gonna be a little hectic a lot of studying a lot of school but i'm hoping to of course have so much festive things and just get in the holiday spirit as well so yeah today is actually november 30th because to make it work that you post every day in december you have to film a day ahead so I do have an advent calendar, but we are going to be starting it tomorrow. I will show you guys that later. Um, but today is my later classes. So I had one at 1 and one at 4. I'm not going to the one at 1 because it's just like a little discussion group for my film class. Not important. I just have one quiz left to finish off the course. And he basically gives you the answers in the lectures. So I don't really need to go to the discussion group. And I have like so many other things I need to be doing, which... I didn't <laughs> um, it's currently 1230 but all morning I've been sitting there on my laptop and I made the intro you guys just watched and the outro that you guys are gonna watch at the end of this um, it took me like two hours to make them and it was good I used um, on there you get Microsoft's clip champ which I've never used that before I think it's somewhat new I think it's trying to be like a competitor for Premiere Pro um, and I actually really liked it. I've used Premiere Pro in the past, and I like Clipchamp better. Um, so yeah, I'm, I might use it to edit future videos, although I kind of hate editing on a laptop. That's why I, I edit these on my phone, and it's actually <laughs> really easy. But yeah, enough of that. Um, in a few hours, I'm going to be heading to campus for my business discussion group for the day today we're just listening to presentations next week I'm presenting so it'll be nice to just kind of see what other groups did and then maybe you know alter mine um but yeah so let's get on with today and I'm so happy for vlogmas all right hello so it's been a few hours and I've just been hanging out um honestly I could have been way more productive today but I just I couldn't do it let me show you what I'm doing so I just spent an hour and a half on this reflection, which is worth 5%, when I probably should have been working on my actual research essay, which is worth 25%, both for the same class sociology, but I don't know. I've just been doing too many writing assignments that I needed that like creative one. It just, I needed to do it. So I did it and it was very fun. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm going to be leaving for my discussion group in probably like 20 minutes so i'm glad that i got something done today at least so i can't be like super mad at myself <laughs> we all procrastinate right oh and i just remembered because at two i had to take my antibiotics for my wisdom teeth that i never gave you guys an update earlier so it has been five days since my surgery today's thursday i got it on saturday so yeah, and honestly, I didn't ever get any swelling. The pineapple juice trick works. Trust me, drink pineapple juice before your surgery. I drink three full cups of it. So I don't know if there's like a science to how much you should drink, but like that's what I did. <laughs> um, and yeah, it works. Pain-wise, like if you touch it, it hurts. And if I talk or if I smile or if I yawn, it hurts. Um, but it's not like unbearable pain like it's noticeable like I know it's hurting I can feel it but it's not like oh my gosh ow I can't talk ever again <laughs> like it's not like that it hurts but it's not bad and I've been slowly able to eat more and more foods last night I had pizza I cut it up super super small and um, just had like cheese and it was fine it took me a long time to eat it. I probably looked really weird eating it because I had to keep it with my front teeth that could chew. Um, but I did it. Um, so yeah, I think the healing process is going well. I'm still doing antibiotics and of course salt water rinses, which I hate because I don't like the taste of salt water, but 
yeah, so it's going well, and I'm really happy about that. Um, and the recovery time was not that bad for me. I mean, obviously, I'm still in a little bit of pain, but I would consider myself good. All right, we're making our way now to the bus stop. Let's hope the bus actually shows up when my tracker thingy says it's supposed to. It's, it's hit or miss, really. So we'll see. Let's hope we get there on time. It's either this bus or we miss class, which would be very bad because this class takes participation into account of your mark. So let's hope. This fruit has been in this bus shelter for weeks and it's like, I don't know, it doesn't look like it's not that moldy, like that piece of watermelon is, but like so weird and no squirrel has found it. Like what? Walking up the hill to class. I am done class and I'm heading home. It's 5.30, it's pitch dark outside, so let's see how this is. Tunnels for the win. These hills are going down and up for sure. Woo! I left during daylight, coming home while it's dark. You guys can't see me, but it's it's actually not that cold out, which is pretty nice. Um, but the bus I took, the bus driver was not the one that knows me, so he didn't drop me off closer. So I have to walk a little bit farther, but it's okay. Here's my dinner I had to make myself. We have some nice alfagetti and some bread with butter. Let's eat this. Okay, I'm done my dinner. It was good. Took me like 45 minutes to eat it because I had to eat it so slow. <laughs> but luckily the like soup, the tomato soup part really made the bread like basically melt in your mouth. So it was, it was good. It was good. Um, but now I'm about to hop on a meeting with some of my partners in a project it's for extra credit um so it's not it's not that deep but like we're just gonna meet up finalize some things and then on the weekend we're meeting up again so you'll see that but um yeah so i'm just gonna hum on and then i will see you guys later this is how i'm waiting for people to join my meetings hello i also i don't know how i blurred the background but i don't know how to undo it got my sticky notes what am I listening to? Billie Eilish. I did not make this playlist, but um, it's actually good for doing work and studying because it's not like too upbeat. So yeah, shout out to this person for making this playlist. All right, so just finished off that meeting. We're in a good spot to present for Tuesday, so it's looking good. Um, now it is time to end off the vlog because it is 9 p.m. And I like to get in bed early when I'm not staying up late working on things. So before we end off the vlog though, I do want to show you guys the advent calendar. We are not opening up a day today because it is November 30th. It makes sense to like for the uploads if you start a day before. The first day of advent is tomorrow, but I'm going to still show you the box because it is so beautiful. Let me go get it. It is oh my gosh. <laughs> the Body Shop advent calendar. Um, I got this big one two years ago, but it's like different design, different products in it. Last year I also had a body shop advent calendar, but it was the smaller one. Um, so this is the bigger one. It is called a gift of change advent calendar. This is what it looks like. It opens up and it has a cute little scene in there. And then we got the drawers. There's two drawers. One, oh, one, this is really hard, one and two. <laughs> um, so yeah, let me give you guys a little montage. I am super excited to open the first day. But we gotta wait till tomorrow. And tomorrow I have an early morning. So an 8.30 a.m. class. 6 a.m. wake up to take my antibiotics. And then 8.30 class until 3 p.m. So the advent opening is probably not going to be until later. But stay tuned. 
So that is it for the first day of Vlogmas. I'm so excited to be doing it again this year because I love the memories. I love looking back on it and just being able to see what I did all throughout December of whatever year and also just like the festivities. I just love it so much. So I hope you guys are going to stick along and watch all of Vlogmas with me and yeah, if you are, be sure to let me know in the comments and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye!